A committee consists of six members, A, B, C, D, E, and F. A has veto power, B, C, D, and E each have one vote. F is a non-voting member. For a motion to pass, it must have the support of A plus at least two additional voting members. So there's the key phrase. Got to have A plus two additional voting members. And also we notice that F is a nobody. Let's just cross out F, cross out F because F is a non-voting member. Okay, so let's... Um, what they want us to do is they're saying show how to represent this situation as a weighted system using the lowest numbers possible. This is kind of a strange question. They basically want us to change this, uh, these words and rules to something like numbers, like, like maybe a quota 10 and, you know, 4, 2, 1, 2, I don't know, three, four, whatever. I'm just making stuff up here. They want us to set up some kind of situation, some kind of number for the quota, number of votes for A, B, C, D, E, and F, so that the number situation will be the same as the words, the rules they're giving us. How can you make numbers that will play out exactly the same as these words? These are kind of tricky. Well, um, whoops. Uh, what, what, what we basically do is we start guessing around and we check our guesses. So let me, let me, and they say, you know, lowest numbers possible. So let's start, let's keep it as simple as possible. What do you got to have to pass something? A plus two others. So let's say three. Let's just start with that. Maybe our quota is three. Remember, that's the number needed to pass anything. That's what the quota is. It's the number needed to pass anything. So maybe you need three to pass anything in this system, okay? And then each of the people just has one vote. One, two, three, five. Oh, of course, an F's got to be a zero, right? A, B, C, D, E, and F. F's got to be a zero because zero is a non. F's a non-voting member. He's a nobody. But we'll give each of the other ones one vote. Now, so is, does that work? If if we did the numbers that way. Does that fit the situation? Is that going to work? Um, not quite, no. Well, you might think at first, yeah, because you got it says you need A plus two others. So if you have like these three, A, B, and C, that's A and two others, that'll be three votes. That'll pass it. That looks good so far. Or what if you have A and like C, D? Those, three, you know, A and two others. That'd be three votes. Three votes is what it takes. That'll do it. So what's wrong with, why isn't this the answer? You, you see it, don't you? What if just B, C, D without A? That would be three votes, and that would be enough to pass, and that's not supposed to be, right? You, you, you have to have A. It said A plus two others. This would be a way of not needing A. So this is wrong. No, A would not be needed in this situation. So that's, that's wrong. That's not a valid answer. That, that doesn't fit the word. So let's, let's try. So we got to give A more. Why don't we give A two votes? I'm just going to change that. I'm going to try to change the least I possibly can. So we'll give A two votes. B, C, D, E, F still gets zero. So if we give A two votes, because A is more important, right? Somehow we got to up the importance of A. What if we give A two votes? Now, what should I put here as the quota? What does it take? It takes A and two other players, right? A plus two others. So that would be four votes. How about this situation? Does this look good? Right? You need A and two others, like ABC would work. That looks good. Let me uh, fix this. Right? Or you could have A like with CD. ACD, that'd be four votes. That's perfect. So is this is this right? No, same problem as last time. You could have B, C, D, and E all get to add, together. That's four votes, and they could pass something without A, right? You got to have A. This is not going to work for the same reason the other one didn't work. Again, no, A is not needed because you could just have B, C, D, and E all get together without A and pass something. So let's... Let's go up again uh, one more time. So let's, what if we raise A up to three votes? One, 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 zero. 
So this is A, B, C, D, E, and F. How many votes for the quota? Remember, it takes A and two others. So that would be five votes, wouldn't it? Because you need A and two others, so we better make the quota five. So if we make the quota five, that's the number needed. Let me write that a little better. So if we make the quota five, then it would take A and two others. Looks good so far. Could be A and these two. That'd be five. That works. Now, the question is, can they do it without A? If all four of these get together, that's only four. They can't do it without A. This is working. Yes. These numbers will fit the rule perfect. They got to have A and two others, any of the two other voting members. Uh, and, and, and they got to have A. The other four voting members can't do it without A. Right? So this is a yes. Here, actually, let me get rid of that. So this one is a yes. They got to have A and two others. So then there's the numbers. Quota's got to be five. A's got to have three votes. One, 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 and zero votes. That's the number situation that will fit these words, the rules in these words. That's a number scenario that fits.